start coming into the art department, um, you're basically a, a straight painter, which is painting walls, you know, rolling walls, cutting in, you know, cutting trim, painting houses. Um, and I guess you move on to uh, to a scenic. The more you learn um, different techniques, I guess you just pick stuff up. Um, like I say, the way we learned it here was a lot faster than I think people traditionally learn how to do things in the film industry. Um, there's different parts uh, of uh, the art department. There's you know there's prop painters, uh, there's set painters, um, there are uh, the decorative painters as far as um, the uh, what department am I thinking of the um, Set, set decoration, which would be mostly furniture and different things like that that go into sets. Um, so there are different elements when things get on camera. You have the physical set that the acting is done in. Um, you have the props that are used um, for different things, which can be you know, manipulated and changed to look certain ways. Um, and then you have the set decoration, which would be the furniture, drapery, um, things like that. Um, carpet, whatever, um, that can be aged and manipulated as well. Um, everything specific to the set, everything's uh, period specific. Uh, things are, um, you know, timeline, how, how much they've been used. <clears throat> the, uh, the, the, the director of photography, the art department, everything has to be controlled, has to be in a controlled environment um, just to prevent, you know, the, uh, the unknown because, uh, you know, time is money. Um, so things are, you know, rehearsed, gone over a hundred times probably before the camera ever sees it. Um, you know, that's where the art department comes in to make sure everything <clears throat> looks a certain way uh, before the camera gets there. And that's a whole, you know, they probably start six months, I would guess, before uh, shooting begins sometimes to get things ready. Um, everything's approved by the art department, by the production designer, uh, the re director of photography, the director. Um, you know, there's all these different elements to there's you know plasters come in um, you know plastering walls creating different finishes different environments um, carpenters uh, prop makers you know people are all constantly building things everything's made a certain way you know to look a certain way working on a sound stage everything's controlled you're you're in a controlled environment it usually has heat or air um, the sets are built specifically for the shots they're shooting. Um, at that time, um, you know, you have access to, uh, usually if you're on a sound stage, the, uh, you, you know, your, your base camp is close by, which is, you know, your, your scenic department, all, all of your construction is usually close by the, the sound stage. Um, so you have access to a lot more, um, just a whole lot, lot, lot more things, kind of a safety net. When you're on location, um, you're out, you can be anywhere, you can be in the woods, you can be in a city. Um, you know, you could be on a lake, you could be, you know, so many different places, you don't know what you're getting into, really, until you get there, or I don't. I think a lot of, you know, a lot of departments, um, the department heads know what's going on, but as, you know, things get farther away from that, you, you just, you don't, you don't know what's coming. Um, and you have different things like, uh, you know, you have uh, weather conditions, um, you have, uh, you know, people that are around, pedestrians that are around, um, you just never know what's going to come up. So you have, uh, you know, basically you have the, you know, the scenic artists, you have the greens department um, are there to um, to hide things that shouldn't be in the shot, I guess, you know, to, to gear things more towards uh, what they're filming at, at the time. Um, so a lot of different things can happen on location. That's one of the things of being on a film crew, you have to keep it together. There's so many people doing so many different things. Um, so many departments, um, and everything's got to be right uh, in that moment. You know, in the moment of filming, um, you know, you just do your job. You know, when the when when things are uh, when there's a lot of pressure, um, things are happening very fast. There's not really time to think. You just do it, um, and that's you know that's kind of what we're all there. There's there's you know everything is micromanaged. Every department is um, has a specific job to do. Um, and if, you know, if you had more than one thing to do, I think it wouldn't, uh, things wouldn't go as smoothly.
So, uh, yeah, you just deal with it. You know, there's a lot of downtime, and, you know, it's kind of like being in the military. You hurry up and wait. You know, you're, you're in action for a few minutes, and then there's, you know, hours of, of waiting. So, um, you know, and the thing, they always get their shot. You know, things always, they always work out in the end. So, um, it's a creative process. You know, I mean, it's the whole process. You're part of a, a giant creative process. I think that, that's kind of the, um, the beauty of the whole thing. Um, you know, it's good to see your work on screen. You know, you get a, you know, you get a screen credit and you, um, you know, you can actually see things you've done. I, I've seen things that I've, um, you know, that I've done in the literally 30 seconds that were the center focus of, of a shot, you know, so, um, you know, you just never know, uh, you, you never know what's going to happen. I mean, there's a million things that, that, that come up during filming. Um, as far as gratification, you know, um, it's just being part of the process, I think. Um, and see, seeing your, your work on, on screen, you know, it's um, being part of a big, big creative process. You're one, one little piece of a big, big giant thing. And when it comes together and works out, it's, it's, it can be amazing. You know, it can be really, really beautiful to see. Um, the whole thing come together. Um, it's very different being there um, than it is looking at it on a, on a TV screen. You know, that's part of the magic of, of, of filmmaking. Um, what you can create within that, that environment, within that little square that people see. You know, that's, it's pulling that off is the beauty. The gratification, I think, is, comes from that.